Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Vice President Kamala Harris needed to pick a white man for her 2024 ticket, Charlemagne, the God claims. The radio host was disappointed with Harris's selection for her running mate but said she did it to make Americans feel more comfortable with a minority woman leading the Democratic ticket. Charlemagne said that Minnesota Governor Tim Walz is Harris's DEI hire, referencing a term often used by Republicans in a derogatory manner to reference minority hires who they claim are not qualified and only selected to fill some demographic quota. Harris announced on Tuesday that Walz would join her 2024 campaign after narrowing it down to him and a handful of other white men. I just found out about him over the last couple of weeks, Charlemagne told ABC This Week host John Carl. At first, I was a little bit disappointed. We knew she needed a DEI hire. She needed a white male to make America comfortable, he continued. It is what it is. No need for us to, you know, act crazy about it. We know what it is. Others who were considered for the job before Walls was selected were Pennsylvania Governor Josh Shapiro, Arizona Senator Mark Kelly, Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg, Kentucky Governor Andy Bashir and Illinois Governor J.B. Pritzker, all white males. President Joe Biden, 81, ended his re-election bid last month after weeks of pressure to step aside in a chain of events that started with his disastrous debate performance against Donald Trump. Biden immediately endorsed Harris, and she quickly took over his campaign infrastructure. Walls, 60, clinched his spot as Harris's running mate during a meeting at the vice president's residence in Washington, D.C. last weekend where she met with him, Shapiro and Kelly. People involved in the selection process claim that Walls's low ego approach to the number two spot is what secured him the job. I'm not angling for anything else, Walls assured Harris during their chat. I'm at the end of my career, the father of two said, according to a Politico report. This is not about me. This is about America's working families. Walls and Harris appeared alongside each other for the first time as running mates at a campaign rally in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania on Tuesday evening. Since becoming the presumed Democratic candidate, the VP has barnstormed key swing states and now has her running mate on the road, as well. But Harris has still not held a press conference, sat down for an interview or answered a single question from reporters since entering the race for the spot behind the Resolute desk.